Hello and welcome to Matt's Reloading Bench. Today I've got the 6.5 PRC back at the range. I'm going to be doing some bullet seating depth tests. Uh, I'm going to be starting at uh, 15 thousandths off of the lands and working all the way to 33 thousandths off of the lands in 0 .002 intervals. And uh, we're going to see if we can get some better groups or if they're worse than they were before. So stick with me and we'll find out. This five shot group is 15 thousandths off of the lands. At 15 thousandths off of the lands, I had a group size of 2.25 MOA with a mean radius of 0.61 MOA. The average muzzle velocity was 29.75, and an extreme spread of 15.89, and a standard deviation of 6.33. This five shot group is going to be 17 thousandths off of the lands. At 17 thousandths from the lands, my group size was 1.4 MOA with a mean radius of 0.49 MOA. The average muzzle velocity was 29.73 with an extreme spread of 7.0 and a standard deviation of 2.49. This five shot group is going to be 19 thousandths off of the lands. At 19 thousandths off of the lands, I have a group size of 2.05 MOA with a mean radius of 0.6 MOA. The average muzzle velocity was 29.68, an extreme spread of 18.96, and a standard deviation of 9.49. This five shot group is going to be 21 thousandths off of the lands. At 21 thousandths from the lands, I had a group size of 1.82 MOA with a mean radius of 0.64 MOA. The average muzzle velocity was 29.70 with an extreme spread of 20.73 and a standard deviation of 8.95. This five shot group is going to be 23 thousandths off of the lands. At 23 thousandths off of the lands, I've got a group size of 1.79 MOA with a mean radius of 0.61 MOA. The average muzzle velocity was 29.68 with an extreme spread of 19.25 and a standard deviation of 8.8. .8. This five shot group is going to be 25 thousandths off of the lands. At 25 thousandths off of the lands, I had a group size of 1.86 MOA with a mean radius of 0.63 MOA. The average muzzle velocity was 29.68 with an extreme spread of 21.82 and a standard deviation of 8.32. This five shot group is 27 thousandths off of the lands. At 27 thousandths off of the lands, I had a group size of 2.42 MOA with a mean radius of 0.96 MOA. 
The average muzzle velocity was 29.67 with an extreme spread of 15.82 and a standard deviation of 6.72. This five shot group is 29 thousandths off of the lands. At 29 thousandths off of the lands, I've got a group size of 1.34 MOA with a mean radius of 0.48 MOA. The average muzzle velocity was 29.63 with an extreme spread of 14.86 and a standard deviation at 5.66. This five shot group is 31 thousandths off of the lands. At 31 thousandths from the lands, I've got a group size of 1.05 MOA with a mean radius of 0.39 MOA, an average muzzle velocity of 29.59 with an extreme spread of 12.16 and a standard deviation of 5.03. And this last five shot group is going to be 33 thousandths off of the lands. At 33 thousandths off of the lands, I've got a group size of 0.94 MOA with a mean radius of 0.36 MOA. The average muzzle velocity was 29.55 with an extreme spread of 16.24 and a standard deviation of 6.63. Well, we've got that all done. I'll go home, take a look at uh, the group sizes and uh, Look at the chronograph, see if there's any significant changes in muzzle velocity, standard deviation, or extreme spread. And I'll make an informed decision on which seating depth is going to work best for this particular load. So stay tuned. Well, after reviewing all the data, the decision that I've made is I'm actually going to load uh, in between the 31 and the 33. So I'll be loading at 32 thousandths off of the lands. The reason being is both of the group sizes are very similar. And I just, I like the consistency between the two. And the standard deviation and extreme spread are very close as well. Um, they're the two best groups that I've managed to get between the whole uh, gamut. So I'll be loading that up at 32 thousands off of the lands and uh my next video will be trying to shoot it out to a mile so stay tuned and wait and see how that turns out if you like this video please let me know hit the thumbs up if you have any questions or comments about anything that you've seen please let me know in the comments section below if you like my channel please subscribe to it Hit that bell icon so that you can get notifications for when the next video comes out. And until next time, shoot straight and be safe.